Hello, I'm Colum Brunel. And I'm Adrian Gonzalez. We're going to do a little video on possessive pronouns in Arabic. Show you how it works, how it's why, and how it's different from the English grammar, and um, give you details on the endings. So basically, uh, in English you will have the pronoun and then the word. Well, in Arabic, you can't see the pronoun, but you can recognize it through the word's ending. So let's start with showing you the pronouns. You start with Anna. And the ending will be E. <laughs> then Anna is I, obviously. Yes. So it would be my when you have E at the end. Mm -hmm. Not, and then not no, or we, that ending is no. no. <laughs> Let's continue <laughs> with the fun. <laughs> and um, anta, ta? and the ending is this. Ka. Ka. Anti. Ti. Kuma. No, she was never not the same. Let's continue. And Kuma. Kumal. Antum. Kum. Antuna. Kuma. Pua. That's just a hill. Kia. Ha. Ha. Kuma. Kuma. Kum. Kum. Kuna. And that's the ending. So as you can see, it's very simple and very easy. So good luck.